I'm Adil Kumar and in this video we'll practice how to write equation of a line from given slope and y-intercept. Now if the slope and y-intercept is given to us we should use slope intercept form of equation. So we have slope intercept form of equation which is slope and intercept form of linear equation which is as written above y equals to mx plus p. So if you are given slope and y intercept always use this form of equation where m is the slope of line right slope of line and b is y intercept okay. Now y intercept is a point where the line crosses y axis so let us say here is a graph of of a line let's say the line is kind of like this where it goes through let's say this point is 1 for us then y intercept is 1 okay let's say this point is minus 2 for us then we'll find equation of this line later so that's the line this is x axis and that's y axis well the exercise here is find equation of a line from given slope and y intercept so let's have few practice questions a we are given slope of the line m as uh, minus 3 and y intercept b as equals to 5 how will you find equation of a line now clearly y equals to mx plus b is the equation of the line m is minus 3 so we can substitute m as minus 3 we get minus 3x b is 5 so we can write this as 5 so that becomes the equation of line it's that simple right let's take another example and let's take slope as 0 this time and uh, y intercept as 2 how will you find equation now well we'll begin with the equation y equals to mx plus b substitute 0 here we get 0 so y equals to 0 plus 2 or the equation is y equals to 2 so that becomes zero slope means a horizontal line so remember if slope is zero we're talking about horizontal line right so horizontal line okay let's take a few more examples and let me write down fractions so we have uh, c m equals to minus 2 over 3 this time and y intercept b equals to let's say 3 over 4 in that case what is the equation well straight away substitute so we have y equals to mx plus b so we can write y equals to slope is minus 2 over 3 okay and b is 3 over 4 so plus 3 over 4 correct so that becomes the equation of line right so that is how you can easily write down equation of a line in slope intercept form when slope and intercepts are given now if a graph is given to you like this how will you find equation of the line well let's take that as the last example here so from the graph given right so graph on the right okay here we see that the y-intercept b is equals to 1 how about slope m is equals to rise over run correct so in this case what we find is that if I am moving from this point to there rise is 1 right so rise is 1 run is we are moving 2 units to the right correct you could do that or you can find the coordinate points so this point here is the y intercept so we can say this point is a so we say a is is the point 0 1 and let's say this point is b for us right so b is minus 2 0 okay slope is m we can write slope m as y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 y2 minus y1 0 minus 1 0 minus 1 divided by minus 2 minus 0 minus 2 minus 0 that gives us half right positive half you could do that also or from graph you can go rise over run so you're going from here one unit up right so that is one and two units to the right so half either way so you can easily read slope and y intercept from a graph and write equation as y equals to slope is half x 
plus y intercept 1. Do you see that? So that is how you could find equation of line in slope and intercept form when slope and y intercept is given to you, right? Now the question for you is to find equation of y axis. Now here you have to find equation of y axis. How will you do that? Right? So that is a question for you to do. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope you find it very interesting. You can share and subscribe my videos. Let me give you the answer of this equation also. Here at every point x value is 0. So the equation is x equals to 0. Since the slope is undefined, we cannot write in that form. So we have to write in a different form. x equals to 0 is or x equals to the x-intercept when the line is vertical. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.